Hi Porsche 917 fans. It's Jack again on the 91710, Joe Sifford's car. It's uh, July 31st, 2017. I figured I'd do an update. Yeah, this is where I have to work on it, huh? Somebody's got to do it. I'm working in this garage here to finish it up, kind of reminiscent of Ken Tyrrell's garage at his lumber yard where he built the, the first Tyrrell Formula One car. I've got the nose sitting out here. I'm starting to finish that up uh, to get a fit to the car. I've got the, um, the tail section sitting in the bushes there waiting to get going and get finished up. The problem I'm having now is the problem I've always had. Getting the engines running, getting a computer to run the engines. Now they finally make one. Mega Squirt makes a, an, a computer that I know will run a, th a 3.0 Subaru six-cylinder engine. But the problem I've had all along is getting somebody to do the work. I had a guy that was going to do it in May. Tomorrow's August 1st and he still hasn't gotten back to me to do the work so I decided I'm going to do the work. But at this point, the problem is I've run out of money. I'm retired on a fixed income, and I just don't have the $2,000 I need to buy the computer and some other parts to finish this. What I've, what I've done since the last video is put the Tilton pedal assembly in for a manual transmission. I took the automatic transmission out because nobody makes a, uh, a computer to run it. So I had to switch to manual. I have a early uh, Toyota MR2 cable shifter in there. I'm going to run the cables along the back here to the manual transmission. Factory 5 Racing makes a plate to go on the back of the transmission which will convert this to two-wheel drive. And then I connect the cables to the shifter location, run them down the side of the engine right to that shifter. So between the computer, which I'm going to have to wire myself, these pieces, and the paint for that bodywork, I'm short $2,000. I'm thinking of putting together a GoFundMe page, but I'll start with this video. If anybody's dying to hear this, this engine run and wants to contribute some money, I would appreciate it. This is 6 liters, 12 cylinders, all aluminum, dual overhead cam, four valve per cylinder. It has four valve per cylinders rather than the two with the Porsche. And I've got the, the firing order staggered so it'll go one cylinder in each engine at the same time staggered. They'll fire together and they'll be staggered. So the sound will come out of the exhaust staggered rather than at the same time which will make it sound like a six-cylinder engine. So this is going to sound like a 12. Again, the details that I put into this to make it look like a 917. <clears throat> so that's where it stands. Seven years after I was ready to start the engines the first time, I'm still, still waiting. And for $2,000, that's what's holding this whole thing up. So if anybody wants to contribute towards that number, it's not a lot considering how many people are on this planet. Uh, but I'm stuck in the water uh, until I can either sell something. Anybody want to buy an airplane? That's a Quad City Ultralight Challenger 2 sitting under the tarps there in the bushes. I want to sell that. So, anyhow, this is where it stands. I found out that this color of Joe Sifford's car is... Uh, 1971 Tangerine 018. Uh, so I finally figured that out. I know what I'm going to paint it now. So anyway, give me a hand. I'd appreciate it. Leave a comment if you're interested in contributing. I'm going to get this link for this video off to Jerry Seinfeld. See if he has any pocket change he contribute to see this replica running. All right. So that's it. Thank you very much. Bye.